Hello folks, yours truly, Randy Rand here for today's talk. And I want to briefly discuss about the um, talk about the Oscar boycott. Now, certainly, you know, I understand if you're an actor or an actress, um, you know, you, you like to be uh, commended for your work. You want to be awarded. You want to be recognized for your work. And there's certainly nothing wrong with that. I, I think there are many uh, actors and actresses that are certainly worthy of um, getting such a, you know, an award or, or such a prize, you know, or, or any kind of award like that. I, I, I think it's great. You know, if you are good at what you do, say like a Denzel or even a Will Smith or um, other actors and or actresses, Jennifer Lopez is pretty good too, I think. Um, she, she takes over every uh, movie that she's in. I think she's very good. I think there are a lot of them. Uh, Lawrence Fishburne is another one of my personal favorites. Morgan Freeman is, is good. And there are many, many others. And certainly, again, if you are an actor or an actress and uh, you perform well, you certainly want to be uh, recognized for it. Certainly, you're paid very well for it. But you want to be recognized for it. And I can certainly understand that. In boycotting the the Oscars, I think, you know, I think you want to be very careful, and I'll tell you why. You know, you don't want to have it so that you raise so much of a stink, you know, that, you know, well, from for future reference and, and from now on, we're just going to throw any old black actors or actresses' uh, work into uh, nominations just to quell the noise, just to shut people up. You know, and uh, you don't want to do that. You don't want to do that. But yet, at the same time, I understand you want to be recognized for your work. And yes, there is a need for diversity in the Oscars. There's a need for diversity all over the place. Um, and since I'm talking about diversity, you know, it's one thing to boycott the Oscars. Okay. But, you know, if you're going to scream for diversity in the Oscars, in the nominating process, and so forth and so on, I think what's more important is that we have diversity in some of the, the, the courts that we have, uh, you know, all across the country because, uh, you know, there's a lot of injustice going on. There's a lot of injustice. And I tell you, you know, and like I said, it's one thing to boycott the Oscars, but what really bothers me is that some of these celebrities are lending their voices. They're using their celebrity. Uh, to cry out for diversity when they should be using those voices um, for for seeking justice for many uh, people that have been uh, quite frankly screwed over by the ju the judicial system, you know. Um, but at the same time, we we need more diversity in the judicial system. We need more diversity in the police departments all across the country. You know, we need more uh, diversity with the judges. As a matter of fact, on my radio show, um, I talked about that. We need more women lawyers and judges. We need in politicians. We need more uh, minority, blacks, Asian, um, Arab, you know, uh, lawyers, judges, and, and, and so forth. Uh, in the judicial system, I can understand why, you know, you want to boycott the Oscars. I certainly understand. However... Um, I think your time would be better served if we uh, put our voices together and raised our voices, especially those of us uh, who have the uh, celebrity and the attention-getting ability to seek social justice. And I'm not saying that, you know, nobody else has anything else to do. We as regular folk have much more to do as well, but... Um, I think we need to, to do more of a job, and certainly a better job, of uh, seeking justice uh, for our communities. In fact, I think we owe it to our children, you know, so that they can learn a lesson from all of this. Uh, you know, raising our voices, collectively raising our voices, raising our celebrity voices to, to work and, and fight for diversity in the Oscar nomination process but as well as seeking diversity in uh, other areas of life that are a little more important than receiving a trophy. Yours truly, thanks for the time.